What is going on? Back again. It is your boy Sniper Jones, Snipe Squad. If y'all is in here, let me know down below in the comment section. Y'all already know how we rocking, man. Today's video is about the Yeezy Beluga 2.0s, man. I have the box right here. Y'all know how we do it, man. A regular 350 box. Got the boost on that thing. Flip it around. Size 12 game. Got that retail tag right there, so you can check that out too. And now we done with that. We definitely don't need that box. Yeah. We can go ahead and toss that. Kanye promised everybody, right? When when the Yeezy hype was first bubbling up, Kanye made a promise. He said, hey, look, I'm going to guarantee everybody a pair of Yeezys. You know what I'm saying? Everybody is going to be able to get a pair because everybody was complaining that they couldn't get a pair. And what's crazy about that is the same thing with Jordans, right? People cry all day about not being able to get Jordans. And when Jordan made too many, nobody wants them no more. Bam, man, this is the pair that Yeezy made available for just about everybody. I believe this is the like the biggest, uh, most released Yeezy uh, so far, man. This is the this Yeezy has been the most released so far. I believe 90,000 pairs were made of these Beluga 2.0s, man. And for a guy like me, I'm not tripping, right? Because if y'all know any of my other releases, I do general releases all the time. I really don't care about what sits, how many was made. If it's a dope shoe and I like it, I usually pick it up and bring it to you guys. So this is actually my first time hitting for a retail price raffle. Uh, and I couldn't be more excited, man. I wound up hitting for uh, three of these. I won four, but I only got three, you know how to be back doing. And I was super excited, man. Now, as far as the review standpoint, man, this shoe honestly is very basic to say the least. As y'all can see, it really don't have too many different colorways besides a lighter gray, and then you have like a darker charcoal gray. And the only color that it has is this beluga orange, and or if you want to call it a burnt orange, I'm not even sure if beluga orange is a word. What? Bro, what are you talking about, man? But that is the only color on the side right here and on the back pull tab that you will have. That's the only color you will have, man. But I'm gonna just try to give you guys an overall breakdown of what I think of this sneaker. Starting right here at the bottom, man. You have the boost technology that's in all Yeezy V2s. Right here on the midsole, man, going all the way around the entire shoe. You should have that translucent rubber type bottom going around the entire sneaker as you see right here. And then straight to the uppers, right? So the uppers, you see that supply 350 that's on all V2s. The entire upper is just a, a lighter gray with a charcoal gray. And it has like the same little designs that like the zebras have. It has these lines going all the way across designs going around the entire shoes the same thing going on here with these beluga 2.0s man the only hint of color you will have is right here on this supply 350 and on the back of this pool tab where you get that it's more, almost like an infrared or like a or like a heightened orange man it's, it's kind of hard to explain i didn't lace these yet because i didn't rock them yet i was gonna wait to do that on the on foot but yes man these are the easy beluga 2.0s now i got my pair from uh foot action with the bag and receipt right here, man. So I don't know. It was, man, listen, Jimmy Jazz here got him. Um, DTLR got him. I'm, I'm looking on my phone, you right, right? And, and I see people getting stabbed, you know what I'm saying? People just getting shot for these Yeezys, man. And, and I'm kind of happy uh, that he made them more widely available for people because I don't really feel like the pressure is really that high. Like when people start doing all that extra stuff, man, you kind of got to just fall back or just find a better way to handle it. And making a lot of pairs makes it so, you know, everybody ain't gotta fight for a pair, you know what I'm saying? Everybody ain't gotta shoot nobody for no pairs. And it's crazy people doing that over shoes these days, but that's what's going on, man. Now the retail price for these were 230, and uh, mine with tax came up to 239, man. Uh, the resale though, that's the thing with this shoe, right? Resale is dying, and it died fast. Um, like I said, I won three pair. Um, I sold one, and I still have the other. Uh, I might just keep it, man. Keep it for trade bait, you know what I'm saying? Or uh, keep it, maybe a giveaway. Like, I don't know, man. I might just keep it and uh, just keep it up, man. Because at the end of the day, you're not really going to get what you want for it unless the price jumps up, you know what I'm saying, soon. And like I said, I'd never hit for a raffle before. So when I hit for four, I'm like, wow, man, that's crazy. And it happened to be the most easy, easy to get. And that's fine with me as long as I get my pair and I got it. So I think I looked on StockX for these and they were going for like, Man, the highest I seen was like 425, right? And and that's low because if you look at any of the V1s, or you know, if you look at any of the V1s or even the earlier V2s, or like the Oreos or Solar Reds, they're going for eight, seven, six hundred dollars. So for this to be only at 400, I seen a pair of these go for like 350. It's crazy, man. So if you plan on reselling this shoe, I would tell you it's probably best if you just keep it, unless you absolutely need the money. 
and do what you do, bro. With me personally, I'm gonna just keep those pairs that I got. Um, I love it. I actually, I do like this shoe. I'm really looking forward to getting the blue tints that's dropping in December as well, man. So, um, hopefully, I mean, I can get my hands on those too, right? I mean, I know uh, people want them to be limited and they want to be the only people that have them, but at the end of the day, man, I don't care who the hell has them. As long as I get my pair, I'm perfectly fine with that. But enough of me talking, man. Let me go ahead and give you that dough on foot, man. Let's get it. Jumping in hard away. In the skillet with magic. Bad bitch, bad habits. Yeah, the money gotta have it. I used to dream of living lavish. Now nigga living lavish. Buy a phone with to see what's fast. If I ain't eating, then I'm fasting, yeah. Fatty fuck bottle coop, jerk to see if I can fit in. Yeah. It didn't work, so I gave it. That is my dog show. That is my dog. That's my dog show. That's my dog. Me and my dog. We get them two in a row. Me and my dog. We get them two in a row. That you keep on calling. She says you ready to pull up. As soon as I get there, talking. I'ma be on the floor nails. I'm on my way. I'm going fast. I'm coming home to get you home. I'm that is it for the video, man. Make sure if you're new to the channel, you hit that sub button. Let me know if you got your Yeezys down below in the comment section. Please, guys, once I hit 1K, once everything 1K, I am doing a giveaway. Three winners, man. I am so close. I thank each and every last one of y'all for showing me love in the comment section. Talking to me. I love talking back. Make sure you follow me on Instagram. That will be right there down below. And without further ado, gang, gang.